Okay, so, um, I had to make a video before the clip that I'm going to show you. Um, as a lot of you guys should know, based on my last couple of uh, uploads, I do bi-weekly streaming at the arcade, and I play pinball. Usually I go for a high score attempt, um, I challenge people, do whatever, that's not, that's not the point. So I've been doing these streams for a couple weeks, and um, this last week that I did one, we were there for my stream, but we were also there for a surprise party for our friend Cece. And the Brewers game was on, and it was a good fucking game. It was a tight game, and it, it was, there was a ton of shit going on, and I was stretched between three separate things, trying to keep track of the game, and also trying to be involved in the party because I was in the middle of my stream, which was... I was also trying to be, obviously, pretty, you know, I was trying to be there and involved in for it, so... I mean, why would I throw it, or why would I put it on if I wasn't fucking trying to... I'm, I'm digging a hole, I'm sorry. Um, the whole point of this particular video that I'm filming right now is to set up what you're about to see. So, somewhere in the stream, about three quarters of the way through, I start taking challengers, and I play Charlie, and then Jovi comes up to play. Now, Jovi proposes to me. So I guess I should, you know, if you're watching this video, you've looked at the title of it, obviously. We are engaged. And um, the reason I'm making a huss and fuss about it is because I had no fucking idea, like the title suggested, that that's what was going on. See, Joey <clears throat> tells me all the time, you know, I'm going to marry you one day. I'm keeping you forever. You're mine forever. And I tell her that all the time. So it's just a normal everyday thing to me. And um, so we're, we're at the arcade. The stream is going. And you'll see it in the clip. She comes up to play a game. And she makes the proposal. And I say, sure. I say, yes, I say, sure. Because the, the, the fucking deep romantic that I am, I say, sure, because I don't understand fully what's happening at that moment in time. Now immediately after that, she comes in, she gives me a hug, and everybody starts clapping and cheering. And it's at that moment, the little light clicks on my head, and I'm like, oh, shit, I know what just happened. And not, oh shit, like, what the fuck did I just agree to? And oh shit, like, I cannot fucking believe that I said sure, and looked like an idiot in front of all these people. But given the information, ah, fucking light went out. Whatever, I'm rolling with it. Given the information that I've already told you, you know, I'll just turn into the light. Um, Jovi says that to me all the time and it's a normal conversation for us so we go through the thing and at some point in the stream I don't know that I don't know that that clip will be in here I'm gonna try to keep it as, as complete as I can so that there's a lot of context but I tell her like I had no fucking idea what was going on and um, I, I figured I'd jump jump in front of the bus on the stream because my original plan was to play it off like I knew exactly what was going on and just hope that nobody saw me uh, look like a fucking buffoon. So I decided instead what I would do is jump out in front of the bus, admit that I didn't know, take it head on, and then it would be funnier that way and I could make jokes about it, which is what I'm doing right now. So what you're going to watch as soon as I'm done babbling here is the clip of her proposing to me. Um, so yeah, there's the proposal, there's the cheers, then we play our games, and then at some point I start to explain um, that I'm a moron and I just didn't understand it. So there you go. Um, there's, I, I, I wasn't lying. There was no clickbait in the title of this video. I got engaged and, uh, during the proposal, I had no fucking idea that that's what was happening. So go ahead and enjoy the uh, video. Feel free to sound off in the comments if you want to. Congratulations. You're a fucking moron, whatever. I've got it all coming my way anyway. So just go ahead and do it. And, um, I will keep anybody that's interested updated with uh, when we set a date or a location or anything like that. So enjoy the clip, and I will see you guys in the uh, in the next video. Adios. Are you playing now? Yeah. <laughs> Tip me over. Yeah! Like a 
to pick a finger that I'll actually fit on. There you go. <laughs> My fat fingers. Now I'm gonna kick your ass. You're gonna kick my ass now? Yes. Yes. Or not. Or not. That's fine. I don't I don't need to. I don't need to. You better do better than that. I better do better than that? I would hope you do better than that. Alright. That's a pretty pathetic story. So anyway, you're about to watch me look into the camera and uh, directly shake my head and say no. And what I'm doing is I'm addressing Jovia's Uncle Jim. Hi, Uncle Jim. He showed up in the stream in the chat room and I thought it was weird all night because he was chatting to me, which you can't do on Steam or on fucking Twitch, Steam, Steam stream, Twitch. You can't do on Twitch if you have an account. And I thought it was weird because I didn't think that he would make an entire account just to chat with me and if he did then that would make him the sweetest man alive but I didn't think that was the case but I didn't necessarily dismiss it which is why that never clicked in my head so yeah I'm gonna look at the camera I'm gonna shake my head no and I'm addressing his comment in the chat which was he said sure did he really understand what just happened and as you're gonna see the answer was no which I've already explained so that's that now we continue It was a silly piece of wood. <laughs> it's adorable. <laughs> showed up in the Etsy, the Etsy package the other day. Oh, gotcha. Did you wonder why you didn't get to see what I got in the mail? I, you, just, yeah, it just kind of disappeared and then I like immediately forgot about it. <laughs> it wasn't even my plan originally to do it on a stream. I was going to do it when we met Seth, but we didn't get to go meet Seth, so. Well, Jim, Jim had asked me, they're laughing at me now. Why? Because I said, sure. And Jim goes, did he really understand what just happened? And I said, no. Not until the moment everybody started clapping. And then I was like, oh, shit. I'm a fucking idiot. I totally predicted that was what would happen. To, to be fair, she threw me a surprise birthday party a couple years ago. And it took me up until the party was almost over. And she had to actually tell me, these people are all here for you and your party. Because I never thought that was ever going to happen in my life. And I was like, oh, it's just a happy coincidence that I was supposed to go disking with somebody and there's like 15 other people here. And, and we have cake for some reason. Yeah, and we've got cake and I don't know, it's a good day for cake. The weather's <laughs> nice and like we're grilling and people keep saying happy birthday, but like that's not for another couple days. And like, yeah, I don't know. Everybody's being fucking weird. Why is everybody being fucking weird? And she's like, is it's for you? And I'm like, oh. So yeah, I just don't, it's, it's a good, it'll be a funny story now, but yeah, I just don't fucking get it. You can look back on it years later and be like, this asshole said sure. <laughs> <laughs> like the most nonchalant response. It's a plan, there is no plan. So the There's video, never a plan. the video should be over now. So is there anything you want to say? Um, he stuck with me. He's a sucker. I win. Which my mom, see the fucking <laughs> light again. The fucking light again. Come over here. We'll just walk into the bar light. You can kind of see. So, um, God, that's dark. Yeah, I, I, I'm stuck with you, but my mom said that uh, when you did it, what'd she say? Um, you already knew you had him for life, so what was this a formality, essentially? If I remember right. Formalities are king. Cash is king. <laughs> 
and cash and formalities are king. We don't have real kings anymore, so it's just cash and formalities. Kink, yeah, whatever you said. It's whatever that drunk bitch said. Um, cash and formalities. So, yeah, uh, we're, we're engaged. I'm the woman of the relationship. <laughs> she proposed to me. Um, and uh, like I said at the head of this video, we will keep anybody posted that wants to know. Um, <laughs> that's not... <laughs> I'm sorry, I have to. That's not going to delete me uh, for saying nothing, essentially. Anybody that actually wants to know and keep up with our lives, we will keep them in the loop uh, with a date and a time. and uh, Keep conventions on the mind. Yeah, just keep conventions on the mind. Just think conventions and not social. Just nerd. <laughs> um, and yeah, we'll, we'll move on from there. And I'm sorry it's so dark, but the fucking timer on our apartment building... For the light is on a seemingly random dimer, so nothing I can do about that. Anything you want to say in closing? I love this nerd. I. <laughs> eh, I love you too. I love that nerd. <laughs> there we go. It was like right. It was so low hanging, and I couldn't grab it. <laughs> it was almost as if I was as, as metaphorically short as you physically are. Anyway. I'm a tiny. <laughs> So thanks for watching. There it is. It's all explained now. Everything that's been on Facebook and whatever is, is I guess now. Uh, Facebook official. Yeah, Facebook official. <laughs> so and I suppose when I go back in, I'll throw up a, uh, a photo of the ring that she got me. It's not the real one. It's not the real one, and I'll throw up the real one after the fact, um, which I will head off by making another video in the apartment with, with good lighting. <laughs> And then there you go. So thanks for watching. Now enjoy um, a picture of the ring she got me and then a video of me saying this is the real one and then the real one. <laughs> Adios, everybody. Bye.